There. Today we're joined by the camera fox. She's the one holding the camera. <laughs> All right, we are making smoked chicken wings. Me, <laughs> me. Go. Yep. All right, so smoked chicken wings. You will need Worcestershire sauce, hot sauce, or barbecue sauce. You can also add some zesty Italian dressing if you want to add a little bit of uh, zest to it. And if you like salty things, um, what's it called? Soy sauce is great for adding that. So we're going to use a little bit of Worcestershire sauce. I'm only going to use about a half a cup because it's just a marinade. Pour it in our back. Now I'm making three different types here. Okay. The last one isn't getting as much because it's less. This is going to be a barbecue one that's more for the kids. Yeah. Then we have an extra hot hot sauce. We can use your favorite hot sauce. And since we have so many people in this household, it just benefits me to use a bunch of different types. I'm going to use probably about half this thing. So it's going to be about a cup. Now that we've got all of our hot sauces in, we have the extra hot. I like hot sauce. This isn't for today. You're just going to zip top your bag and you're going to mix it up. That's going to be amazing. Now we have our extra hot wings, our regular hot wings, and our barbecue wings. You're going to want to marinate these overnight. However, if you don't marinate them overnight, you're going to want at least three hours in the bag. This way they can absorb some of that beautiful flavors. Put them right in the refrigerator. Alright, you're supposed to fill this thing up with your chips down here. And take the whole thing off if you want. It only holds like half a cup. Put it in. Turn it. Yeah. Turn it back around that way, and you're good to go. Now if you were to actually open this and look, it's in there. Alright, I'm going to get this thing cranking over to heat it up and kind of sanitize it with heat and smoke. I actually won't be cooking till tonight, but yeah. I'm going to set the timer. 10 hours, because it doesn't really matter, we're actually not going to keep it in there that long. Now we're going to set the temp. So we fun. So here's how I'm going to do this. We got our chicken wings marinating pretty much all day. Turns out tomorrow we're supposed to have a really bad storm. So I'm going to do this now. now all your juices in here is basically garbage. Because I had chicken. The reason I'm wearing this because I have a cut in my hand. So. That. So I'm just gonna grab our very, very juicy chicken wings here. For some added flavor, we're going to sprinkle some applewood rub on them. Any barbecue rub will do the job. And now we just repeat the process.
Then I'm going to take them out to the smoker. I actually mixed some hickory and mesquite wood together, threw it in, uh, set it for 275. You're going to want to put it in for about 45 minutes. And then come out, flip them all, and leave them for another 45 minutes. However, you don't have to do that. You could just leave it in there for about an hour and 25 minutes, an hour and a half, and it should be okay. Um, I'm actually going to do that. I'm going to leave it in there for an hour and a half just to see what happens. Because the when I've seen other people do it, they flip it, but realistically, you're just smoking it, and it's got an ambient temperature of 275, so you shouldn't need to flip it. Um, let's see what happens. I'm not going to take you guys with me, because it's really muddy out there. So, we'll see it after it's done. Now we got the hot ones on the top, and the barbecue on the bottom. It's only really important at the beginning because you don't want the super spicy sauce to drip onto the barbecue ones. It's barbecue smoked wings, hot smoked wings, extra hot smoked wings. They're over here, Now it's time to give these babies a try. I'm excited. Alright, so we got our smoked barbecue wing here. Let me give this one a try. really good. It's got a nice sweet smokiness to it. Barbecue-y. And now, I'm going to go for the uh, hot smoked wing. Real nice strong smoke flavor to it. Not too awfully hot. It's got a nice zing to it. Definitely touching the tongue. All right, now we're gonna go for the extra hot one. Not sure how hot this is because I've actually never tried the extra hot hot sauce that I used. So. Mmm, very good. Definitely extra. Extra spicy. Very extra spicy. Oh my god. It's amazing. Man. I think maybe I should have left them in for an extra half hour or so just to get a little bit more of the fat out of the skin, but they're fully cooked. So an hour and a half without flipping them was perfect. And they just fall right off the bone. So good. I highly recommend you guys try this one if you have a smoker that you can use. If not, I'm very sorry, but amazing. I've never had wings this good. I'm a spicy one. Wow, I'm starting to sweat. Thanks for watching. Y'all like and subscribe. Uh, and keep on eating happy, alright?